everybody, it's Maggie Mohart from Modern Salon TV. I am here with the Michael Sean Corby of Living Proof. What's your title here? I am the Global Creative Director. Oh, how appropriate. I love that. So we are here at the uh, America's Beauty Show, ABS in Chicago, and you have such a gorgeous booth, and you're part of? We are part of the premiere, celebrating 30 years. I can't believe it. And we just joined Premier, and I have to say they're doing a fantastic job here in the Midwest market. They're just amazing. Well, it's so great. So he has these two gorgeous guys behind him, and we were talking about the things that people do right and wrong, and you're going to give us a little tutorial. So I'm give you a little tutorial. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I feel, oh, you're going to hold it. No, I'm going to hold it for you because <laughs> I know you yes. need your hands. Because I kind of need my hands. Yeah. It's really hard for a hairdresser not to use their hands. So look, a lot of you are doing great cuts. A lot of you are giving your men a good blow dry, but then you put in the product and it starts to get lost. So what I'm going to show you are a couple tips and tricks about applying the product. So follow me this way. And I'll go over we'll here so that, to, yeah. We'll get to Johnny later. I know everybody's looking at Johnny. But so what we got here on Bailey, Bailey, we gave him a great haircut, or I have to say, I didn't give him a great haircut. One of our creative team members, Adam here, gave him a, cre a creative, beautiful haircut on stage here today. He's gonna be assisting me here to uh, get his hair in tip top shape. A lot of you, what you're doing is you're relying on your clays, your pomades and your pom paste at the very end. And what we've done at Living Proof is we have made our clays and our paste with the ability to be used wet to dry. So no more gel, no more mousse, no more any other product. You put those in and then you build the volume through. So with Bailey, we went in and we've already put the paste into his hair, the forming paste. And so what that leaves us with, I wish you could feel the texture, is it's very textured, it's very malleable, and we just used like a Denman brush and went all the way through the hair with the paste. It's gritty, but it's not that final hold that we need. So now what we're gonna do is we're going to take the molding clay like so, the molding clay. And I'm gonna show you a little secret. When you're using that, you want to take the clay always with your knuckle, never with your fingernail. I know you ladies with long nails are like, finally, right? I don't have to have this thing in my, where you're cooking your chicken dinner, you got stuff in your nails. It's gross, right? Keeps your rings clean too. Always use your knuckle, take a small amount because you can always take more. Then remember that these are paste, waxes, clays. This is all in one. It's really a pomade. So put it in your pomade. Always in the palm of your hand and then keep it in your palms, right? So notice I'm not doing it between the fingers. I'm not going to the fingertips. Everything is strategically kept at the palm. So now what I can do is I can use my palms to really push the hair and to control the hair in the direction I want. And I have a lot more power that way. Instead of just sort of piecing it out with my fingers, I can use the full force of my palm as I'm applying the product. Thank you for following me here. Now I know a lot of you want like that cool boy band look for your clients as well. You can always just take a little more clay in always in always in always in the back of your finger emulsify it and what do we call this maggie palmade right palm that clay even right and so now what i'm going to do if i want more of that lift in the front i'm literally able to just push with the palm and really hold it but leave the ends free leave that really cool spirit and flow to the hair also guys if you're getting those poofy sides you know the like eddie munster thing is going on you can totally just push this down beautifully at the sides of the hair which i'm loving this so much yay that's got to be like the nicest guy's cut on the floor Amazing, right you right? did that whoop, whoop, whoop. bravo adam, what adam. adam what were the biggest challenges with this haircut so he's got a lot of heavy, heavy straight hair. So every time you cut, the hair moves. So it's really following the hair where it wants to go, cutting, combing, watching it, and letting it kind of tell you where to cut. And he also used 
you were at the launch of our smart methodology. That is 16 cutting techniques that don't change the way you do hair, but you can adapt them to what you're doing. So he used axis cutting and aircrafting and tool tools. So he's actually able to use clippers, oh yes, and razor and scissors today. It's a great haircut. And so now I'm gonna have Johnny take a seat and I'm gonna do the same thing on shorter hair real quick. Yeah. yeah. Johnny's just sort of been the rock star of the show here today. <laughs> and so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to just achieve a little bit more of a sculpted look with the product. And again, the knuckle, and I, I mean, I, I don't want to sound too duh, but it's for, um, it's more sanitary? Is that, why do you do that? A, it's more sanitary, but for me, it's also easier to portion control. When you're using your finger, some is getting under your nail, and then it surprises you later when you least expect it. To me, when I keep it in my palm, it becomes like a palette, right? So in this case, I want to add a little texture between the strands. I can now take this on my fingertips and not have too much. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> we were getting into it. I know, I was getting I was into it. And so now I don't have too much. I'm able, so now my fingers are my paintbrush. Take your fingers are your paintbrush. And now just go between sections. Don't go in every section, because then it's like a Bart Simpson or something. Go between the sections, and that's going to give you that beautiful sculpted look. And then, as always, finish with that side pat. If you have gone longer than a week for a haircut, guys, or ladies with short crop haircuts, giving it that side pat using the clay will help it lay down all day. We're so excited about these. They're brand new to our Style Lab franchise, and I'm so excited to be here with my good friend Maggie again. Oh. I just love being here. I mean, this is the high. This is the highlight so far. I mean, I just got here an hour ago, but it all is, right, well, it is I'll my, take it. I'll it take it. Highlight. So, for more information, people go to www.livingproof.com. Yeah. Super easy to find, and follow us on social at Living Proof Inc. And you can find everything about Living Proof. We're very active in the social community. Check us out. See what's available, and become Living Proof. Yeah. As I always say. We are the science, MIT science, you've been there. You've been in the lab, real scientists, and by the way, female scientists, right? The women are creating these formulas. And we are the science and you are the living proof. So we live it every day and we're so glad that you're here. Oh, it's so great. And thank you, great haircuts, beautiful. Yeah, right, yeah. rock and stuff. Okay, we'll <laughs> thank you, Bye. Maggie, Thanks. bye.